What's going on everybody? Welcome back to NB Edits. Today, Nick and I are down here in the De Pere area of Wisconsin and we are going to be fishing the Fox River. As you can see, right behind us, the water is completely open, no more ice. It went out a few days ago. And we are down here, ready to grind, ready to catch some walleyes and start ripping some lips. As you can tell, we've got a lot of vehicles behind us, like an At least absolute, 10. <laughs> more than 10. Maybe 10,000, but... Apparently everybody knows the Fox is open. Yeah, the Fox is open, and we've just got an absolute ton of people down here, which is expected because this is one of the best walleye fisheries around, and it's, I mean, it's world class. So, we're gonna go ahead and get out there. Uh, we've got a lot of fishing, a lot of filming to do today. Cody's got his new boat. We wanna show you guys that real quick. Look at, look at that guy. There he is, chilling at the Swamp Donkey up there. Cody's so new at, boat. Uh, yeah, Cody's got a new boat. We're just hanging out for a little bit before we go fishing. We are at the Swamp Donkey trailer. We've got a tournament coming up soon. As you can tell, we're getting ready for that. So it's gonna be pretty awesome. And we're gonna be fishing it in Cody's brand new boat. Not bad. It's um, it's a decent boat. Cody picked up a new Triton, got a good deal on it. And uh, he's super, super excited. This is gonna be the first time that we're gonna be fishing out of this boat. Um, he took it out a couple days ago just to kind of get grasped on things. And uh, no fish just, has been caught though. No, no, he hasn't done any fishing. No fish has been caught. So uh, we just picked up some baits from the guys in the trailer and stuff like that over at the old Swamp Donkey. So got some jigs, we got some more aggressive baits and stuff like that we're probably gonna be throwing today too. So we're gonna go ahead Get, uh, get everything all packed up, drop the boat in, and we'll see you guys when we get out there. Well, here we are. Made it out on the water. Feels a little weird. You know, I'm used to uh, walking. The past six months we've been walking on water. So it feels really, really good to be actually out here in a boat. Really, uh, really excited to get out here and smash some walleyes. That's the goal today, right? That's Hopefully, get some walleyes. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna fish probably till the fish stop biting. Early in the morning, we'll be done. Whenever the fish stop biting, could be two weeks. I don't. <laughs> we could just keep on going. We'll sleep out here. Survival video out in the boat. No, but there's a lot of boats out here. Everybody obviously is out here chasing walleyes, and yeah, it should be a really good time. It's about 50 some degrees out, I think. Kind of windy, but really, really beautiful weather. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna see if we can nail them. So stay tuned guys, you're not gonna wanna miss this one. Oh. Well, that feels good. Finally, got a fish in the boat tonight. You know, we were just out here two weeks ago on ice with these guys, and uh, what is it, not even two weeks later, and we're out in the boat, in open water. And, uh, got a nice walleye. First one of the night, too, on a plastic. But, just a little one, little guy. Hopefully tonight we can get one that's uh, double the size of this. We're gonna try some trolling tonight, but. Up, right now we're just up here having a little fun with the jigging rods, and uh, trying to catch some fish, so. Awesome. It feels good to catch a fish again. And I'm the first one to catch a fish in the new boat. <laughs> I let I let these guys fish before me like all day. And uh, oh, okay. they didn't catch anything. So I'm like, so all right. You're about to well, be anchored. Well, I'll teach you guys how to catch a fish. <laughs> Nick, how do you feel about that? The case that? was I didn't want to feel make them feel bad by, you know, like me catching the first fish. Yeah. So I let them catch the first. Now, speak what you will. Now it'll happen. First, first fish of the day for Brando. Not a giant, but we'll take it. I'm actually using a plastic. Wow. Just a giant, dude. Absolute beast. I think it's, I Tell think you it's what, bigger though. than mine. There it is. First one of the day for me. Tried choking down that green plastic. I got some custom jigs that I picked up over at the uh, Swamp Donkey Shack before we hopped out. So. We're gonna go ahead and get a release on this little fella, but first one of the day for me. Go ahead and drop him overboard. See you later, buddy. Feels pretty good to be back out here open water. We're looking to get into something a little bit uh, a little bit bigger, but the bite hasn't been too crazy, so we moved up towards the dam. And uh, well, it's two fish now, so yeah. they're obviously here. 
We got warmer water, a little bit more oxygen for them. They're definitely moving up shore. So what the heck what do are you doing? We're gonna get some bigger ones later, dude. <laughs> Trolling, we're gonna get. Some, we're gonna 29 incher tonight. 29. Yeah, he broke his PB with me last. 32. Year. A, what was it? 29 and a half. 29 and a half. 29 and a half. We're gonna get him a 30 tonight. That's the dirty 30. He's gonna be part of the club. That's bold. Definitely better than the first. Definitely dogging me a little bit. A nice one. That's what we're looking for. There you go, buddy. That's more along the size of what we're looking for right there. Chunky monkey. That's what I like to see. Check out the gut on him, as always. Not a bad one. Probably, uh, what do you think? Just over that 20 mark? 20, I would say, you want to bump it? I got a bump board. We could, I might as well, I guess, right, guys? All right, why not? Let's get her on the bump. What do we Just got? to get an idea, we got 21 and a quarter. Quarter. Yep. Almost 21 and a half. One last look at her before she goes back. 21 and a quarter. First decent one of the day. <clears throat> there she goes. She swims off. Water's a little chilly to be honest. We're gonna go ahead, get the baits back out there and see if we can find bigger. Alrighty guys, well, sun is going down. We've got uh, maybe another five minutes or so we're gonna give it, and then I think we are going to transition into night fishing, which we are gonna be trolling tonight, as Cody was saying earlier. Um, we just came up to the dam because the bite wasn't super aggressive um, downriver, so we came up here. We wanted to nail a couple fish before we got out trolling tonight, but uh, I think we're gonna make the switch, probably our last cast here, and uh, hopefully we plug an absolute giant tonight. Well, sun is pretty much all the way down, almost. The boys in the back are getting the trolling rods out and set up right now. And hopefully Cody can get us a freaking giant tonight. I mean, I'm still looking for that 30 incher. Every time we come to the Fox, that's the main goal. Brandon came close with Cody at 29 and a half, which was a pretty nice fish. But I've heard and seen people catch a lot bigger. So that's kind of the goal. Trolling on the Fox at night is definitely one of the best ways to get that really big 30 incher. So they're setting up and hopefully the next time you guys see us, we're gonna be hooked up and it's gonna be a big one. Hooked up everybody. All right, you and the fish man, you and the fish. I'm gonna grab a net, the small one. Actually, it's not too bad. It's not bad. Uh, hooks off in, in the net. Actually, there's some weight there. There's some weight there. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Nice first fish, good start. Take a look at that. That's a beauty. All right, well, first one on the night. How's it feel? Feels good to actually catch one of these. There it goes. There's another fish. Oh my gosh, Here, we're doubled up. That that Hold was up, awesome. Baby. Let's go. That was okay. freaking awesome. Uh, she Logan, hit it three up. times. Put that. Put, you're gonna I'm have gonna to grab my camera. Up. Look, we're not even 30 minutes into this first pass, and <laughs> this honestly doesn't feel like a walleye. It might be a little musky. All right, I'm gonna... All right. Oh, that's not bad. Here we go, Nick. Get in the net. Let's go. Woo! All right, Cody is battling that. To show you guys, quick little walleye. Nothing too impressive. I didn't even think there was a fish on, but I'm gonna get a release on it right away. But no time so we can help focus on whatever the heck Cody's got. So I'm gonna, gonna figure I'm gonna it out turn here. On the what in the world is it? I have no idea. It's a fish. Is it hooked in the it's fin? A fish. This is getting nuts. Like everybody I'm trying to help record launching. for Cody. Yeah, which we got yeah. the, the nets cat. all over the lines all the over. The giant catfish, cat. guys. Big oh boy. Cat. That is something. That was nice. also another guess of mine. So that was, oh yeah, it is. That was a pretty good guess. That's a fish. Oh boy. Give me this. Go for it. <laughs> oh my wow. goodness. Okay. Things are getting intense. <laughs> Cody's got the cat. I don't even know what's going Doubled up. Now we're tripled up. Basically, we handled the one fish. 
Oh my Excuse lord. Me, this is getting intense. You guys want to see the giant kitty? <laughs> we're going to go ahead, get Nick's board off. Again, we're doubled up, basically tripled up actually. We were able to handle the one fish as quick as possible. Cody's got this giant cat. Got him. There he goes. Doing some headlamp over here. All right, uh, guys, the, the catfish is gone. And uh, now I'm going to net next fish here quick. That's Holy cow, one. that got crazy. Do we even have a board out? We got here? one. We got one board? <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap, Ola. Yeah. All right. Lift it up, show everybody what that fish came on, Nick. Oh, well, let's see here. There's a lot of hooks, a lot of net going on. <laughs> well, guys, here's the fish. You didn't see much of my fight because Cody snagged a catfish, a pretty pretty large catfish, actually. So we didn't know what was going on there. Uh, we also had another fish hit during that. I mean, it was a lot of chaos, but nice small little walleye. It's a fish. I mean, we had three walleyes and a catfish on that one pass. So, yeah, we're going to get a release on this guy real quick. Nothing too special like a 16 inch wall. Eh? And um, yeah, we're just gonna enjoy the rest of the night. We're gonna help film for Cody because it is really hectic even having four people. So. Oh, that's an archie. It's coming to surface. Not a bad one. In the net. Whew. There we go. Another beautiful walleye, just a short, probably just under that 20 mark. We're gonna go ahead and get this one back into the water. Probably going to be one of our last fish for the evening. So let's go ahead and get a release on her. There she goes. Beautiful. Woo! The wind started picking up on us here. Um, we actually picked up our speed a little bit, and that's exactly when that one just went off. So, but I believe that's going to be one of the uh, last ones. For the night eventually here we are going to have to start picking things up so we're probably going to finish this pass and we'll see maybe we get one more let me go ahead and turn this off quick actually i can just take it off we've got a lot of videos coming in the fox river to pier area here in northern wisconsin so again we're going to go ahead and wrap things up if you guys enjoyed make sure to give this video a big old fat thumbs up for us we love coming out here and uh, doing some walleye fishing for you guys hopefully you guys enjoyed learned some new things if you got questions Leave all of that kind of stuff down below. Uh, we always go through our comment section and uh, answer anything that we can. So hopefully we've been of some help, learned a couple things. Until next time, guys, tight lines from NB Edits.